Let us consider the free body diagram of M1 along with the pulleys attached to it. So from this free body diagram, similarly from the free body diagram of M2, but we have three unknowns T, A1 and A2 and two equations. Let's try to find out the relation between A1 and A2 using string constraints. Let us say that M1 moves a distance x. So we will have a situation like this. We need 5x more string and this should be compensated by the motion of M2. If M2 moves a distance x dash as shown, it will leave 4x dash string extra in the system. For string to be of the same length, extra string needed by the motion of M1, that is 5x should be equal to 4x dash. So we can say that 5a1 should be equal to 4a2. So now we have three unknowns and three equations. Solving this, we get a2 